evening. Good evening. All right. Can you see and hear me clearly? Yeah. Yes. Oh, where are you? Ah, yeah. no. <laughs> can you hear? Can you see me now? Yes, I see yeah. you clearly. Yes. And where are you right now? I'm good. Okay, you're good. I'm good too. Are you at home? Yes, I'm at home. Oh, I see. I thought you were still at work. All right, so now, <laughs> okay, were you busy this past few days? Yes. Yeah, um, so the several days I, I uh, always busy. You're always busy, okay. Because um, uh, there are many uh, pregnancy have COVID-19. Oh, so there are many pregnant women who've got uh, who got COVID nineteen in the hospital. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. So I think it's quite uh difficult for them, right? Yeah. And it's dangerous for their health. So I think, I hope we, they could. Huh? Uh, <laughs> okay. Yeah, All right. Yeah. What is okay. it? Yeah. There are um, um, a special team uh, who cheat, uh, cheat them. Oh, okay. So yeah. not all doctors can treat them, but there are certain team, okay, who can just treat them. Okay. So now, Chung, all right. So we will continue our lesson last meeting about still it's still about unit 12 schools of thought okay okay all right so let's have now your okay here i will show you my screen all right can you see it yeah all right so we have here we will read first the paragraph and then we will answer the questions later on. Okay. All right, so we have here, okay, wait. All right. Okay, so kind of read more than a hobby. More than a hobby. More than a hobby. Mm -hmm. Can yeah. you read now? Number one. Uh, when uh, uh, Wally Stevens walk, walked into his office every morning, his college uh, doesn't know about his secret. Uh, Stevens lived a double life by day. He worked uh, for an uh, insurance company. Mm -hmm. The rest of his life was spent becoming one of the uh, greatest uh, American uh, poets, poets. poets for the uh, 20th Century. All right. Yes, okay, very good. So Chung kind of read this word again. We have colleagues. Colleagues. Yes. Next is greatest. Greatest. Yes. Greatest. And twentieth. Twenties. All right. One more time. Twentieth. Twentieth. Yes, very good. And now we have twenty first, right? Okay, we are now in 21st century, but before, during Wallace Stevens' time, that is 20th century. Okay, next, number two. Uh, sacred uh, talent is more common than we think, even with people who are already famous in one area. Take uh, Lucino 
Pavarotti, mm -hmm. one of the world's greatest classical singers. Uh, not many people know that before he came a singer, he was a, a outstanding football a football player. Mm -hmm. uh, the same is true of TV chef Gordon Ramsay, mm -hmm. who is now well known for his brilliant cooking. And his bad. Oh, oh I, I can see. Can you oh, say? You can. Uh, oh, yeah. right. Can you see it now? Yeah. Ramsay played a professional football for wow. Rangers, one of Scotland's mm, one of Scotland team, the uh, best teams. Yes, very good. Can you say Rangers? R R R Rangers. Yes, very good. So this is Luciano Pavoretti. Okay, Pavoretti. Uh, what's the name? Pavoretti. Pavoretti. Yes, Pavoretti. Next, number three. No, a number of politicians first moved. Uh, their name is one jobs. Uh, uh, is at the jobs. Uh, Silvio Belucan. Brian okay. Mm-hmm. Berlucani. Yes. Berlucani. Prime Berlucani. Minister. Berlucani. Prime Minister of Italian and a businessman. One song uh, professional uh, one cruise ships. Mm-hmm. Winston Churchill. Prime Minister of um, Great Britain also had other talents. He wrote, he wrote great history books. Churchill's book no, won, won him, him the Nobel Prize in the uh, literature in uh, 1953. Mm -hmm. uh, Vaclav. Vaclav Havel, uh, who was the first president of the Czech Republic, mm -hmm. was also a great writer. Yes, all right. So he he was okay. He was a politician. He was a prime minister, right, of Italy and a businessman. But he also sang professionally. Okay, and sang. he, yeah, sang. It is the past tense of sing. Sing, yeah. Yes, okay. And he also good writer. In fact, he won Nobel Prize in Literature in 1953. Okay, next, number four. There are also musicians and uh, actors who has secret talents. Paul McCartney and David Bowie. Okay, Bowie are Bowie Bowie are both painters. <coughs> Paul Mac <coughs> Paul Newman was a racing car driver, and actor Omar Sharif was one of the wonders geotest. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Next, a griotest cast player. Mm -hmm. And only those who go to a little um, hotel, <coughs> hotel bar in New York City every Monday, uh, one uh, wood. Every Monday would know that one of the best mm, uh, clarinet player in the uh, town, uh, actor and uh, film director Woody Allen. Uh, he certainly plays the clarinet better than uh, Bill Clinton plays the saxophone. Okay, very good. So, do you know the word saxophone? 
Yeah, his yes. uh, instrument. Yes. Uh, music. Yes, mm -hmm. very good. It is a musical, <coughs> musical instrument. Okay. All right. So number one. Okay, we have here Wallace Stevens. What is his secret? His secret was what? He's a greatest American poet. Okay, but he worked an insurance company. Okay, he worked for an insurance company, and then he was the greatest American poet. Okay, that's Wallace Stevens. Number two, this is Luciano Pavarotti. Okay, he is one of the classical singers. Mm. Okay, but before before he was become famous, he's one of the most okay outstanding football okay. player of Scotland. Okay. Mm. He was a great football player. And number three, this is um, Winst uh, here, Sil Silvio Birch Lascani. All right, he was a politician. He was a prime minister, but, okay, he sang professionally, okay, on cruise ship. And we also have Winston Church here. He also prime minister of Great Britain. And he has also, he had another talent that is writing history books. He also win or won Nobel <coughs> Prize in Literature. Okay, and we also have number three. We have Vaclav Havel, who was the first president of Czech Republic. And he also was a great writer. Okay, and number four, we have Paul McCartney and David Bowie. They were both painters, but they were also musicians and actors. Okay, mm -hmm. another one is Paul Newman, who was a car driver, a racing car driver and actor, Sharif. He was one of the world's greatest cards players. Okay. And they also work. Okay. Work in the hotel. Okay. So many people have secret talents. So maybe uh, we knew them. Okay. We knew them as, as businessman, president, but they also have talent. All right, so are you ready to answer the questions? Uh, okay, so June, yeah. you will answer the questions here. Okay, let me share you my screen. You will answer if it is true or false. All right, can you see it? Yeah. Okay, so read the text again. Are the statements true or false? So kindly read number one. The people in the text are famous for one thing, but also good at another thing. True. All right, it's true. What about number two? Uh, Wallace Stevenson called the college uh, didn't know he was a poet. Mm -hmm. All right, Wallace Stevens' colleagues didn't know he was a poet. He's a poet. Yeah, he, they didn't know. Mm. Yeah, true. It's true, okay. Yeah. What about number three? Uh, Gordon Ramsay was a chef before he came a famous footballer. Uh, Sure. No. Mm -hmm. So Gordon Ramsay was a chef before he became a famous footballer. I I uh, forgot. You forgot. <laughs> can I? Can right. I? Uh... So let's skip first. What about number four? Berlusconi, Church Chill, and Havel were mm -hmm. all writers and politicians. No. Yes. It's 
No. True. It's two. Yeah. Okay. Number five. Would the uh, Allen oh. place? Yeah. Cardinet and uh, the first of all. Uh, two. It's true. What about number three? Yeah, I don't know what the drums say. What the drop the mm. drums say? Uh, you Robin can find Ramsay, that. Who uh, who is no wow? Oh, he's brilliant cook, and he's playing the drums. I play. Yeah. Oh, what do you think is the answer? Is it true or false? Um, four. It's false. It's false? Yeah. All right, so let's check your answers. <laughs> let's yeah. see if you got the correct answers. So number one, it's true okay number two is true number three is false very good yeah oh number four, four. is false five, four, and four. number five is false too uh. <laughs> let's uh. see four and five are false what's the question berlusconi churchill and havel were all writers and politicians mm. Mm. Uh, no, to, uh... yes that Two of them, two. right? Two of them and are politicians. Them, yeah. Okay, but the other one, it's not. Mm. Okay, that's why it's false. Number yeah. five. No, mm. yes. Yeah. Wood and Ellen play a clean net and uh, Bill Clinton play the fossil phone. Fossil phone. Oh. Two, two people. <laughs> yes, <laughs> two persons. The other one is Bill Clinton. <laughs> Bill Clinton plays saxophone. Woody yeah. Allen only plays clarinet, okay? Mm. That's why it's one. <laughs> All so. right, so you've got three here. Okay, three out of five. Okay. Yeah. Yes, next one. All right, we have another one here, okay? So, okay, let's answer first. So, circle the correct meaning for the words and phrases from text. A or B? Okay, number one. Number one is live a double life. That's paragraph one. Okay, what do you think? What do you think is the meaning of live a double life in paragraph one here? Yes. Okay, what do you think? A, one person had two different lifestyles or our person had a difficult life one person had two very diff diff different life uh, I. it's letter a <laughs> all right let's yeah. see what about number two uh, the same is true of paragraph yes two. the same is yeah. true of this situation is very different from, or this situation is very similar to. Mm. This situation is very different. Situation. situation. Yes. Okay, when we say situation, these are events in your life. Okay. All right, what is situation in Vietnamese? Let's find out. I know, I know situation. You know? Okay, you know situation. Mm. Okay, what is the meaning of the same is true of? Similar or different? Hmm. Yeah, I think uh, different. Different. All right. So you said it's different. So this is letter A also. 
Okay, what about number three? Bad language. Sorry, uh, pray for me and release me. Okay, yes. Yeah. All right, you ready? Yeah. <clears throat> Number three. Mm, yeah. Bad language. Is it A, speaking badly about another person or saying bad words? Bad, bad language. Uh, speaking badly about another person. Um, saying but was all right. It's letter B. Yeah. All right. So let's find out. How about letter B? Made their name, became famous, or learned to do something. Mm, famous. Be became famous. Be all right. So your answer is letter A. I yeah. Okay. So let's find out. If you got all the correct answers. Okay. All right, so number one is A. Very good. One person had two different lifestyles. And number two, it's letter B. Look, mm. we have here, same. Keyword is the same. It means similar, okay? <laughs> yeah, so you found the word same here. It means similar, okay? Mm. All right, that's why it's letter B. Okay, next we have here. For example, too, we have similar job. It means we have the same job, okay? Yeah. Yeah, so similar, yeah, similar is equivalent to the same. It's the same. Next we have number three, it's letter B. Okay, saying bad words, bad language means saying bad words number four it's letter a made their name or became famous all right so your lucky number is number three okay <laughs> all right so you've got three out of four in this activity okay do you have any questions from this activity too um, number two number two Yes. No, I I don't understand. The same is true of. All right. The same is true of. Okay. For example, Jung. Okay. For example. Yeah. Uh, your son. Okay. Your yeah. son won an award. Okay. Won an award for playing. Yeah. For playing piano competition. The same is true of her friend, or the same is true to his friend. It means they also won, okay? Mm. All right, so your son won a competition, and the same is true of his friend or with his friend. It means her friend or his friend also won a competition, okay? Mm. It means they have similar situation. Uh, okay. The same okay. is true. All right. So, do you have more questions? No. No. Okay. So, let's have fear. Okay. Another paragraph. So, June, we have done this before. Okay. We have done this before. You will read the paragraph and find it. It. Mistakes, okay, grammar, spelling, and punctuation. Yeah. 
Okay, so you will tell me if it is if it is a mistake with grammar, spelling, and punctuation. So let's read first. Most efficient grid my belongs either uh, example. Belongs. Yes, it's example. Yeah. Next, yeah. either either to a criminal or the to the men and uh, women who cut them. Mm. A greatest, a greatest of this is probably uh, Sherlock Holmes. Mm -hmm. uh, the home stories were writers by uh, Sir Arthur Conan mm. Conan Doyle, mm -hmm. yeah, a doctor from Edinburgh, Scotland. Conan Doyle knew a lot about the human body and police work, and uh, he he has used this information in his books. Uh, very quickly, uh, Conan Doyle hero became popular. When Holmes was killed kill, uh, in one story, uh, thousands of readers brought, brought, protested. Protested. Brought, protested. Conan Doyle changed his mind and Holmes appeared in another story. Wow, okay. <laughs> so, Jung, can you read this word again? We have written. Yeah. Written. Okay. Yes, written. it should be written, not written, okay? <laughs> Another one is uh, this right. word. Yes, can you read this one? Human. Yes, human. Okay, human. so very good. So, for example, Jung, most fiction's great minds belong. Why? Why do you think belongs is not correct? Mm, not as. Yes, why? Because of minds, right? Nice. It nice. has already S here, so that we shouldn't put S to the following word, okay? Mm. All right, so Chung, I will give you two to three minutes reading again this paragraph, and I want you to write your mistakes here and then tell me later okay okay
difficult. <laughs> Is it difficult? Mm. <laughs> I don't find any mistake. Okay, are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so do you want to see the answers now? Uh, you can just try. I think um, either to criminal or the man. Okay. The man. And this one, why? What's wrong here? What is this? Is what is what makes this wrong? Uh, is it grammar, spelling, or punctuation? Mm, grammar. All right. So you said it's. Uh, wait. Mm -hmm. Okay. Here, grammar. So you said it's grammar. Okay. What else? Okay, do you have more answers? Mm -hmm. How about in this sentence? A greatest of these is probably Sherlock Holmes. Do you think this sentence is correct? It's correct. All right. So let's see. <laughs> How about this? The Holmes stories were written by Sir Arthur Conan Doyle, a doctor from Edinburgh. Ah, not uh, have not the uh, book. Not a verb. Hmm. Oh, why? Is this correct, doctor? Uh, Conan is a doctor. Okay, so Conan is. All right, so this one. What else? Is this the correct spelling of doctor? Chung, is this the correct spelling of doctor? Is this correct? Ah, look at the spelling. It's doctor, right? It's letter E. Can you see it? Oh, hello, Chung. Hello, can you hear me? Hello. Hi, can you hear me? Hello, hello, hello. Can you hear me? Hello, Chu. Hello. Oh, can you hear me? Oh. Why? What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> my phone, uh, uh, my, my phone, my battery of uh, my phone. Oh, so you have it's empty. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Are you okay now? I don't hear you. Oh, hello. Oh, my laptop. Oh, can you hear me? I didn't fix laptop. Oh, no. I All can't right. hear you. Okay, I will call you again, okay? All right, hello, Chung. Sorry, wait, wait for me. me? Um, okay, okay. I'll call you back, okay? To, uh, 